Hi, I'm Faye Roman, your Lent Solar Systems customer service representative. Wanted to talk to you today a little bit about blocking filters. Now when choosing a blocking filter, the system you're looking at will definitely come into play. If you're looking at an LS50, this is our smallest blocking filter, the B400. Now this is great for visual use, but mainly for visual use. You also have the option of upgrading that system to a B600 blocking filter. This will allow you to get a larger field of view if you're possibly trying to image or use binary viewers on the system. Now for the LS60, the smaller blocking filter option is the B600. This is for visual use. If you plan to image with the 60, you'll want to jump up to the B1200. Now the B1200 will offer that larger field of view that you're looking for and allow you more space to do your camera work. Now the B1200 is the smallest option on the LS80. Uh, you can also use a B1800 on the LS80. Again, along the same lines of wanting a larger field of view, you'll go with the larger blocking filter. Now once we get into the LS100 and the 152, we actually have three options. Now we start with the B1200, we can offer the B1800 or the B3400. This is our B3400 blocking filter. Now this is used on either the LS100 or the LS152. It's the largest option for both scopes. The reason you might want to be 3400 is if you're using a large format camera or plan on using binocular viewers. Now the system thankfully can be used visually with the B3400 by simply adding a nighttime star diagonal. All in all a very versatile blocking filter.